I'm Lisa Martin and welcome back to my channel, Keto Kitchen by Lisa. If you're new to my channel, then please watch this video. And if you like the content, then please at the end of this video, there'll be a red subscribe button, which you can click on. And when you do, a bell will appear and you can click on all notifications so that whenever I go live or I drop a new video, you will be notified. If you're not new to my channel, then you already know you're part of my family. And I love, love, love y'all. And I could not have done this journey without you. Um, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. I am going to um, teach you how to make some important spice that we have to have around this time of year. Just because you're keto does not mean that you don't you can't have good things. And this is my second year of staying on keto. I don't want to cheat. I do want to stay on my keto program just because it's Christmas. A lot of people, you can gain between 20 and 25 pounds just the month of December from going um, away from it. So I just don't want to do that. I want to stay on my program. And so I'm going to, on my lifestyle actually. So we are going to put together this gingerbread spice. Now you can buy it, but there's really no need. And all it is, is it's two tablespoons of allspice. Okay. It's two tablespoons of cinnamon. It's two tablespoons of ginger. And one tablespoon of nutmeg and just a pinch of pepper. It's that easy. I mean, we're gonna be using this in a lot of things, so that's why I thought we would make it and that way we would have it on hand. So what I did is I went to, and I this is what it looks like. You can see all that goodness. See what that looks like. You can look at it, see? And like I say, we're going to be using this for a lot of things. So it's just so, so easy to mix up. And just take your other end of your spoon and stir it up really good. And then put a lid on it and put gingerbread um, spice so that you'll know whenever you're making something with gingerbread spice, you'll know that's what we need. So again, it's two tablespoons of allspice. And I didn't know this. I was asked, what is in this? What spices are in allspice? And they said, that's the name of the spice. So it's just ground, two tablespoons of allspice, two tablespoons of ground cinnamon, two tablespoons of ginger, okay, one tablespoon of nutmeg, and a pinch of pepper. That's all in the world it is. And then it turns out to be like that. Isn't that so pretty? And you just like make sure you got some of the spices. None of the spices have any preservatives. And so sometimes you get a little bit of lumps or something. So I just make sure that it's real. But isn't that so good and flavorful? And like I say, this will be our go-to gingerbread spice. So whenever I say this is our go-to, I will share this video so that you will have it. Please give this video a thumbs up and please share my videos and don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. And don't forget to click on one of the playlists at the end of this video so that you can binge watch my videos and YouTube will continue to put me on the suggested videos. I hope to see you here on the next video. Have a wonderful day.